Hi guys, and welcome to another video with me, Shira Star Hobby. I have my very first Boy Blythe TBL unboxing. Um, this boy is named Zachary, and he is actually a partial trade that me and another friend in the dolly world have made. Um, this friend is Hawaiian, and um, he sent me some really yummy looking treats with my trade. I have never had anything with Likey in it, so I'm like super excited to try it out. And here we have some golden plum Lang Li Heng Mui candy. I probably said that wrong. And then we have some Maui cookies white chocolate macadamia nut. So these are probably gonna be in my belly um, <laughs> this afternoon um, as a little snack. So thank you so much for sending these. That was extremely nice of him. He didn't have to do that. Um, <clears throat> so my partial trade is um, I am going to make my friend a doll diorama in one six scale size. Um, he told me everything he wanted and I love the idea of it so far and he's using colors that I love like purple so um, That was what we decided on um, He was looking to move this guy along and I just and of course, you know, I'm like well if you you know if you don't want him, I'll take him, you know, <laughs> so um, So he's actually my first Blythe Boy by this particular artist who is um, Annabelle. I have two more Blythes um, on layaway with her right now. One is a boy and one is a girl. And um, thankfully she is in Chechia, so uh, the shipping isn't going to be a problem. Um, she's like, um, you know, here's Chechia, here's Poland, here's Russia. So like, She's not really affected as far as being cut off from everything and the shipping is still okay. So hopefully um, I will have uh, the other Blythe paid off in a little, maybe like two weeks. And then um, she will be shipping both the boy and the girl together. So I, I also ordered some extra outfits. Um, but anyway, let's focus on this beautiful boy, um, which my friend had him custom made for him. Um, but I mean, he's perfect and he's totally giving me BTS drunk hook vibes with that, um, eyebrow piercing, which apparently he took out already. I don't understand why, but, um, anyway, let's open this guy up and see what all he comes with. Cause he comes with a lot of goodies. <clears throat> so the packaging is really nice. I, I know what to look forward to. Thank you for your order. Um, and all of all of these stickers and things I'm probably going to end up putting into the scrapbook that I'm making um, If you guys watched my last video where I was just basically showing all like the new um, Supplies and things that I got for scrapbooking um, Oh my goodness, I'm so excited So let's see here Okay, he comes with some glasses he comes with like a little floaty. I'm thinking this is a like a beanie hat. Um, a whole outfit. I can see some stickers in there. Oh my goodness. He is so cool. What else did he come with? Um, this really nice traveling bag. Like that's really cool. Um, I think that's it. I, I, I'm thinking he's got an outfit that he's dressed in as well. <clears throat> so let's open him up and see this beautiful boy. Okay. Okay, so he's dressed in his pajamas, which is really, really cute. Okay. Oh, and he's got a hoodie on. Not a hoodie, um, a little hat. Oh my goodness! 
see, now I'm super excited because all the TBLs that I've gotten have been in like a tan skin. And this guy is pale, like he's really pale. So that's awesome because I don't have a really pale one yet. Um, look at his socks, how cute. How cool. And he comes with extra hands too, I believe. Yeah, look at all that, look at all that. So cool. I don't think there's anything else in here. I'm so excited for the other two that I'm getting. Um, Cause they're both redheads and um, I don't have any redheads yet in my little Blythe family. And I don't actually, I don't have any dolls with the black hair either. So that's super exciting. I forgot to show you these. These were in the bag as well. Super cool. So let's get him. Oh, he's so gorgeous. He is really gorgeous. He's got the ears. Look at the ears. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at how cute he is. Look at how absolutely adorable he is. I am so excited for my first boy blight. All right, let's see. Let's see what his eyelids look like. Um, wrong one, Chira. Okay, relaxy mood. <laughs> That's cute. Okay, we got some blue grayish eyes there. I love his little freckles. Okay, we got some like yellowy, blue-gray eyes there. <laughs> oh, oh my. <laughs> um, I hope I can fix that. Um, it just looks like the eye, like the actual eye chip part here just kind of popped out, which I'm thinking you just gotta add some glue there and then just pop it right back in. But I'm kind of afraid to Hmm, I don't know where the actual eye chip went. Um, hmm. Let's see if his eyes will still move. Will still change. Okay, they did. So yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go in. <laughs> We're gonna have to go in and do some Blythe surgery um, to figure out where that eye chip went so I can get that fixed. Um, but he's beautiful. His freckles are beautiful. His eyebrows are really beautifully painted. Oh my goodness. I kind of wish he had some piercings, which I mean, I can just, I can add some myself. <clears throat> um, that way he'll be my little K-pop boy because you know how much I love K-pop boys. And his name might be Zachary, um, but of course he's probably gonna be named Jungkook, which that's cool that she does that, that she actually puts their names in the beading on their pull strings. I like that. Which means that my other two will be coming with this probably as well, so that's exciting. Um, I really can't wait to photograph him. He is, oh, look at that. He's even signed and everything. Oh, I like the stars. You know how much I love stars. Okay, shoot. he's number five out of so he was the fifth doll she made in 2021, but he was in reality the 106th doll she had made, um, you know, since she began. So Annabelle Blythe doll. So what I learned too about this artist is that her and another artist um, have like a joint, um, not really like a joint account, but they both kind of, they work hand in hand. So one lady named Romana Falatova, I believe, is the artist who customizes the Blythes. And then the other lady who is actually Annabelle is the seamstress who makes all the clothing that comes with Ro Romana's dolls. So um, the they kind of share like a Etsy shop. So they both put the dolls that they make, that she makes, and the clothing that the other one makes, they put them in the same shop and sell them, you know, that way. Um, so that's really neat that they kind of do like a, like a collab. 
um, and like work together. Cause you know, one makes the dolls, one dresses the dolls, and um, she makes a lot of really, like the other artists, you know, she makes really cute outfits, um, which I actually ordered two extra outfits that will be sent with my other two when they arrive. So look forward to that. I will take lots of photos, of course, and I will leave some at the end for you guys. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this quick unboxing. Um, I definitely have um, other things coming um, that I need, that I wanna share with you guys. And I have to do like a March update video because I didn't really do one in February. Um, and I need, there's like a lot that I wanna like talk about <laughs> um so that's usually where I do my my babbling is my like my update video where I talk about everything that's incoming and things like that so that will be coming um soon as well um so yeah that's that's it for today um I hope that everyone is well and I will see you guys in the next video bye Um, I decided to show you guys what he looks like now that I fixed him up. Um, his eye chip had actually just fallen out. Um, the glue had probably just loosened and, um, and it was stuck inside of his head. So I did have to, um, I had to unscrew the screws here and I just popped the head open. Um, and while I was in there, I decided to strengthen his neck um, because his head was a little wobbly and I wanted it to hold better because um, not like the TBL Blythes, this is how they come. Um, and some people put in this neck joint, which helps the doll's head to balance properly. And it makes it so that they can look down and all the way up and then, you know, go from side to side. Um, and he didn't have that. So I put a bunch of rubber bands around his neck. Um, and so now his head is not that loose anymore. So that's a lot, that's a lot better. Um, I also changed him into his main outfit, which I love. Like, how amazing is this outfit? Like, suspenders and, like, real pockets and his little superhero shirt. Um, I love this hooded jacket with pockets. Like, I love the clothing that this, this artist makes. Um, Annabelle Blythe. I will leave um, her link and all that information so that you guys can check her out because like I said, the, the Etsy shop is run by two artists. So one artist sells the dolls and then the other artist makes the clothing that the dolls are sold in. And then she also sells a bunch of separate outfits. Um, so, I mean, this outfit is just, oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. He is gorgeous. I also painted on some black earrings with just black acrylic paint um i really wanted him to have earrings and i think it suits him much better um so there he is he is absolutely stunning you guys like i am so excited for his brother to come um and his sister from the same artist like i'm just super pumped um so i hope that you guys enjoy the photos at the end and we will see you guys in the next video. Bye.